It's been a while since I've seen some really good comedy from uh, some of my favorite comedians. So uh, I'm excited for this request. And today I am checking out something I haven't seen in a while. This is Bill Burr. Let's get into it. Let's go. I saw this story down in Orange County, right? Down in Orange County, California, this guy gave helicopter tours for 30 years, 30 years without incident. Hands the business off to his son, the American dream. I built it up for 30 years. Here you go, son. Make the family and the family name proud. All right, Dad, I love you. Right? This poor kid, five days in, he's supposed to give a tour to a couple. Only the dude shows up. The kid thought it was weird, but he's like, I need the money. I got to give him a tour. Right? So he takes this guy up. Ten minutes into the tour, the dude fucking jumped out. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> five days in. Five days in from the balloons and the cake. We love you, son. Keep the family tree going. The traditional life. Five fucking days later, this kid, he probably barely had the speech down. Just sitting there flying the helicopter. All right, if you look out the left side of the aircraft, that's Orange County. There's over 27 miles of beaches. Uh, put your seatbelt back on. 27 miles of beaches. <laughs> Was established as a county in 1903. Sir, please don't open the door. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. No! What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. What the fuck? What the fuck? This is, this is really awesome. Fuck! Fuck! Air traffic control. I don't know who's on this frequency, but you really need some some kind of fucking help. <laughs> <coughs> 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 further into the story turns out the guy who jumped out he was 61 years old terminally ill he was in pain every day they couldn't figure out what was wrong with him and oh well then i guess i, I can kind of understand that i know some people may disagree with it but i guess that will take some of the load off his shoulders he had had enough at that point that guy immediately became a hero in my world right right you know what i love about him not only did he make the decision he didn't go out like some pussy right <laughs> handful of pills Watching a romantic comedy wrapped in an afghan that Nana made. Fuck that. <laughs> this guy went out like a man. Take me up in a chopper. I'm looking at the land I love, and then I'm jumping out like a superhero. I loved it. Wow. Yeah. Can't say I disagree. This guy, this guy should have been wearing a fucking cape. I can't imagine how elated he must have been on that helicopter ride up after finally, you know, just taking back control of his life. Like, fuck you, disease. I decide. You know, ripping tubes out, gets a burger, shotguns a beer. Take me burger. out to the shop. He probably had his fucking foot on the dashboard. You know, he's not even listening to this guy giving the tour, right? Oh, this is a really, really good joke. Really great bit. Bill does like this really amazing job of like like even without the um, the video here, uh, like the way he tells the stories, you can picture it in your head. It's it's, it's funny, and then he does a great job uh, narrating narrating that. Excuse me. out one small thing there is one small thing the guy fucking lived oh how yeah. they, oh. They, were, they were out over the ocean 500 feet up you'd think that would be enough so I'm thinking he must have gone in like Greg Luganis like no splash <laughs> but witnesses said it looked like a dummy was falling out of the air so that sounds like a hell of an impact <laughs> wow I think he accidentally did the most epic 500 foot belly flop in the history of jumping out of a helicopter, you know? But that didn't change what he was trying to do. Where his heart was, I still love this guy. That's messed I up. I feel bad for him. Yeah, so, he should have just actually uh, checked the route first or maybe done a little bit more research. The way down, he's got to be thinking three more seconds of pain, two more seconds. <laughs> wow! <laughs> 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 Right. This is way worse. And as a happy 
pretending, though. He later died at the hospital. Oh. That's right. So he's here, cold for that joke. Sam, God bless him. I hope I have the ball someday. Bill Burr makes my top five comedians of all time as far as my favorites is concerned. I like his writing style. I like his boldness on the mic to say what he wants and his fearlessness. And he's also one of those comedians that is not just good at writing. He's also really good off the cuff. All right. Even if you just sit down and watch some of his interviews, you know, I'm pretty sure that's probably how he gets a lot of his material. I, I would guess he just talks. And then when something he says makes him laugh or makes other people laugh, then he, uh, you know, he just takes a little mental note and then puts it in his act. I'm, I'm assuming that's what he does, because I can't imagine it would be very hard for him to write because the guy is just funny when he's having when you're having a conversation with him. Another thing that comes to mind also is the same way the film industry has been declining in, in terms of quality. You know, if you're a, a big fan of movies or or the uh, music industry has been on decline in terms of quality because of all the technology we have today where you don't need as talented people to do a lot of things. Uh, I, think the sa- I think the same thing is for comedy. I think that a lot of the greatest comedians, they had to really go through the ringer in order to become who they are. They had to perform at laundromats. They had to perform on the street, you know, birthday parties versus today. I think uh, the new comedians, a lot of them are getting big based off of social media and they may be funny writers, but they may not be funny and like can improvise, you know, things that you learn while on the road. You know, I'm not saying that there's not any more funny comedians. You know, that's not what I'm saying by any chance. I'm saying that I just see that there seems to be a decline in all the industries, Um, but it's good that we still have. Legends that are still out here working and uh, putting out a good show. But this was a great reaction. I hope you guys uh, enjoyed it. Uh, Please like the video, subscribe, and hit that notification bell if you like this video. Peace.